Have you heard about color dominance? This is an amazing skill to have that will make all the difference in your color work projects. I have two swatches here, one showing the darker color as the dominant color and one showing the lighter color. So the stitch patterns are completely the same, but you can tell how much more prominent the darker color is here and the lighter color is here. In order to um, achieve color dominance when you're knitting, you need your dominant color float to pass underneath the float of your background color every time. Particularly after your sweater is blocked, those longer floats on the back are what allow the stitches in the dominant color to look like they're popping out because they're actually gonna end up slightly larger than your background color stitches. If you take a look at the wrong side of your swatches or your projects, you can see that one color is gonna have a slightly longer float than the other color. The color with the longer float is your dominant color. In the sweater I'm wearing right now, if I hadn't known to hold my birdies dominant, then I might have them looking a lot more set back into my sweater instead of popping out. 